Hey guys, welcome back to another video on Scylla Stuff and Things. Today we are going to take a little adventure and head out to do some fall shopping. So come along and let's see what we find. Alright, so the first store we are stopping at is Kirkland's. I hope you have one near you because it's awesome. Alright guys, so I'm so excited. First of all, the smell in here is amazing. And last year was the first year we were in our house for fall. So it's some things. We need more wreaths, right? I'm sure Asa would agree. I need this so bad. It's not on sale. Your girl cannot buy anything if it's not on sale. I'll come back in a week and it might be on sale or I'll check online. We'll see. But that's gonna be in my house this fall. <laughs> Just not today. I love that Kirkland's offers Halloween items. I don't really decorate for Halloween. I go straight to Thanksgiving and like fall and all the pumpkins and all those kind of things. That's my personal preference. Let me know down in the comments, what do you guys do? Are you a Halloween and fall decor person? We love that for us. So you can get one item. We actually got this pumpkin last year um, with a P on it. So that'll be in my kitchen this year. I'll have to show you guys that. This is a really good deal on mats, 10 bucks. Um, we had a colored one that we did in our video where we remade the patio. We'll link that up here. Not a good idea. The colors bleed when it gets wet and it gets wet all the time. So I don't know if I want to do welcome or hello. We don't do word signs. We're not big into that in our house and it's so hard because everywhere has word signs now. So I have to find, oh my gosh, I should so get that. That's like me in a nutshell. I mean, I don't have the red truck or any of the hay or the fall leaves, but go team football. It's, it's me. We are getting this. I need a pumpkin one for my front door. We're gonna have to check Hobby Lobby and see if they have a sale on it. This item is gonna be 20% off. That'll be my fall item. And it's still gonna be like $34, which is a lot for a wreath, but I know some of y'all can make that. I'm not that somebody. And I don't have the patience for it. And it would cost me way more than that to make it. So we're gonna buy it. We're buying it. Got them. Okay, so we're gonna pick these up for our buffet that's in the dining room. I kind of like that they're different, the different colors, but it's gonna go with this too. So I'm gonna grab these. Oh, this is exciting. Okay, guys, we're getting closer to hay, y'all. So we're gonna do hay there. I like that one better than hello. Okay. All right, guys, I think we've done some damage here. I'm not, I don't have to buy all fresh because I did buy things last year. I just want to add a couple of pieces every year. That's what I like to do because then it's not all at one time. This is what we came for. That's what we like to see. And you're always going to have your 40% off coupon of one item that's already regular price. So, look, they even put it on here for you so you don't have to do the math. So this is a really good idea, you guys. I always take so many pictures, but then you can go in your yeah. Google Photos and search for like the month or the holiday or whatever, and I can remember what, what decor I have. So, take all the pictures. That way it's gonna be easier to match things up. See like, oh, that's not mine. That was something I was striving to get, didn't do that. <laughs> Pinterest. So like here's my here's my picture from last year of my Thanksgiving table. I'm pretty sure I need this in my life. It's a football cup, y'all. Okay, that's crazy. Hundred and nineteen dollars. Still on it's on sale for seventy one. Still not happening. Some of it's for my mantle and for my entertainment center in the formal living room. If I did something like this, I could actually use this for Thanksgiving and Christmas. So what I'm thinking, guys, is that I can take this and then at Hobby Lobby they have picks. And so you can add to it. So even though I don't necessarily need picks right now, but for Christmas, I can make it look super Christmassy by just adding picks to it. But I love this color. This could be a color scheme for both holidays. I'm getting it. I talked myself. 
myself in the <laughs> See, you guys get to be in my brain today. You wouldn't live out without them. This is meant to hang on your door, but I think you could put this in the middle of your dining room table. So this, you could put on your table. It's meant for your door, but you could lay it like this on your table, dining room table. Make it your centerpiece and then put the candles. Don't use real candles, use fake candles with the um, flicker. You could add pics to this. You could make it look sparkly for Christmas. I think I'm gonna get this too. Normally, I don't know, I like this. Normally I'd change everything out for the holidays, but I could get away with this and just add things to it for Christmas. I feel like we've kind of gone with the natural um, more than like sparkly, but you can add sparkle to it to jazz it up. So I really like these foam coins. Maybe. <laughs> Asa, Asa has an input on this, just so you know, guys. We wa we did another video, and I told you guys he's really into like decorating and has the input. <laughs> Do you like those or no? No, not really. I can tell. I can always tell. Why do these leaves are pretty? That's a lot. <laughs> So I want to know, do you guys go with a plan? I do not. As you can see, you are getting my real and raw, like how this is happening <laughs> right now. Oh, and see, look at that. So that would match the things we just bought at Kirkland. The little succulents and that kind of thing. So each of your rooms could have different, like a different theme if you wanted it to. That's kind of what I do for Christmas a lot. Um, so I could do that for uh, Thanksgiving as well. I, or fall. I keep saying Thanksgiving, but it's really fall. So my formal living room, I could do more formal type. So this would be, to me, formal. We're not jumping ahead, I promise. But I just wanted to show you my thoughts. So you can buy these picks and you can just add them. Like, wouldn't that be pretty? You can just add them to whatever um, decor you decide to go with. So we even have spring decor that has some green colors in it. That's that's even going to work. So make sure you try to work on colors that you can reuse for different seasons, different holidays. So I am not a big knickknacks type person. Like I would, this is not my style, but I like the big pieces that can fill up a spot on my entertainment center and they're easy to just move in and out for the different holidays or if you just want to decorate different. So I think I'm going to grab this. I think that's pretty and I love all the different colors. So I like these. They're going to be a little more earthy tone. It's going to go with the burlap and they come in threes so you have multiple places to put them and they're just a simple, simple little decoration. Hey guys, so it's been a few days and I forgot to close my video out, breaking the snake, but this is my haul. You guys saw a lot of it. You got to come along and see how my brain works, which is kind of scary. <laughs> so make sure you guys stay tuned so you can see the full house and how I decorate for fall. And thank you guys so much for hopping on and watching. We will see you next time. Bye guys.